Gladys match win. Bro, if he wants to do it, I, I would love to do it, but I don't think he's going to. He responded to my tweet and said, he said, if you want to queue arena with me. Bro, we're not on the same team here. We're mortal enemies, buddy. Loyal, if this ends up being a YouTube video, you can, can you put the tweet on screen right now? The, both the tweets? Or maybe all the tweets so everybody understands, even though I think most people understand if they knew the backstory. But bro said, I said, all right, we'll, we'll do a best of three arena on EU servers, because I think he's from EU, just so that he has no excuse, you know? He won't lag, we'll lag. Get your squad together, best of three. And he said, he responded and said, if you want to queue arena with me, <laughs> well, bro, we are not friends here. Not that we're enemies, I'm just messing around. I don't, I don't even really like, I'm not like trying to bully the guy because I'm not. What do I build? I can't like proc any starter items, man. I have to go like ornate or gilded like Yorm. Let's, we'll rush berserkers or something. Let's try that. Gooseberries doesn't work either. Like, literally none of these items work, man. I have nothing to- I can't build any items! <laughs> I'm literally looking at all the items, I, I can't build that, I can't build that. <laughs> I will be buying Shogun's in this build. This one goes out to fucking dualities. This one's for you, buddy. What do I get first? Hi. Two? What the hell is this clear? Okay, we have a Eye of Jungle Zeus that one shot that. I was like, did they like make the camp squishy or something? Because we one shot that. His autos do not proc items. Oh, I'm life stealing. What the hell? This is like Osiris levels of clear level one, where it's like if you just walk up, you're gonna get owned. What the hell was that? Okay, after about 50 seconds of gameplay, I think I understand how this character works. Despite his very, very high skill ceiling. I only got one Gilded proc there. But if it's like... If he's like Yorn, which he very much is can, when it comes to like... What he wants to be. A lane bully plus, you know, not proccing items, obviously. There's a nice correlation there. Then Ornate actually is pretty good. Because Ornate does work on him. Just like Ornate works on Gilded. Or, er, Gilded. On Yorn. Because it's just a flat auto attack uh, buff. It's not an actual proc effect. I also don't know what to max. My two? Three does decent damage, it looks like, but... <laughs> My criticism was that his animations, like, even when you're just sitting here autoing, it just seems like... It's almost, like, too smooth, too quiet. It doesn't feel, there's no oomph to it, you know? It doesn't feel like I'm, I'm a guardian. I'm supposed to be like this, and I'm a big ass whale. I feel like it should have more oomph, you know? But it kind of just feels like I'm humping the air running around the map. Dark if that was a troll. You're the first person I've actually just said that's a troll to, but I mean, cause everybody should know it's a troll. A million subs is in like uh, a million Twitch subs, which has literally never been done. I wanted to try and kill that guy, but I mean, we can go for that. Okay. Okay. Oh, completed. I'll take a purple tiki to start the game, though. 
I think we're just gonna go either phalanx, probably phalanx into uh, shogun's. So we can. The way this character works is that he can't proc on hit effects with his autos, but if you go attack speed on him, he gets haste, so you can run around and hump the air without like slowing down. So he converts the attack speed into haste. So, which is a little weird. It's a little weird, uh, be an auto attack character that doesn't want to really build auto attack items, you know? Yo, I second video game, 6 out of 22 months. Welcome back to the Fonzo family. Saying is the first? Yes, exactly. Karen ult on this guy would have been dope. True. You kind of got to think of his autos as like a mystical male. For the first time, us Soliners, us tanks players can hold left click. He's got two Gilded procs there. Alright, we'll go ahead and back and upgrade our TP, get a Chalice. Although I probably could have killed there, but we'll let him breathe. No pun intended. So I'm playing a Water God. <clears throat> Death does nothing on him, correct. He can't proc it. Pretty good clear, I will say, for a Guardian. Coconut mailbox thanks to the nine months. Welcome back to the Fonzo family. Appreciate that, dude. From what I've seen with his ult as well, I kind of I kind of don't like his ult. Because there's no CC effect close to you. But everything else in your kit wants to keep people near you. So I guess the idea is maybe that, like, while you're diving somebody else, you kind of... You're almost like... Iso ulting them from Valorant. You're keeping just you and that person next to you, and then the rest of your ult will be time dilating them. Because his ult has time dilation, like Oleron, and it stacks. So if they want to walk in and try and help out the person you're 1v1ing, such as the ADC, it's going to be hard for them to do that. But, like, look at this. This is just so troll. Like. And also the 2 cooldown is really low because if you hit auto them, uh, it reduces it. Sinister, thanks for two months, dude. Welcome back to the Fonzo family. I might be able to kill here. He's just gonna ult out. Oh, shoot! No CC me on your ult as well, keep that in mind. Get that Gilded proc. Every time we get a Gilded proc, we're actually getting haste. We're not getting attack speed. Because like I said, it converts to haste. That's kind of funny. Thank you though very much, Sinister. Yeah, I was thinking that Sasquatch. Just like, exists near them and they die build. That could be funny. Like our Thor uh, mystical male kill clip. But on steroids. <laughs> the whale was abusive. Yeah, he does seem like he does have a good lane. Also, one thing that Guardians are very bad at is doing totem, doing buffs, and it seems like he's really good at that because he's like Yorm in that way. Sigil goes hard. If only I could build Sigil on the whale. Can't build Sigil on Magical, sadly. Go ahead and back. I should have got those wards down first, but... I guess I should ult so everybody can see what his ult does. Yeah, skeleton. It's real. He tricked me. Made strictly as a Solian guardian. That was the intention, but a lot of times we know that the intention with gods isn't actually what happens. But I do think he'll be good in in solo, probably. Also, since your uh, your autos don't proc items like Yorm, I think the same thing will happen as Yorm, where if you go like tainted or axe or anything like that, you can't proc it with your autos, so you're literally never gonna. I might be able to kill these guys. Get my time dilation on them a little bit. Oh, that's unfortunate. It was close though. Oh, there was three people there. The whale came as well. Glad I didn't place those wards. Both their ults down though. Your two also makes them do less damage. So the more you can get that on them, the better for like 1v1ing or just like diving. 
Got our Shogun's. That death isn't that bad because we can just TP in. Clashar was probably not the play. I popped it earlier and my autos were healing me for like... Three. I still should probably put points in my stun. It goes up a second. Goes up a lot more damage. The one... It's not really that important. At least early game. This guy has no ult, so we could kill. See, look how often my T comes back up. It's insane. That's just insane uptime on that. This guy's no ult. I'm <laughs> body blocking. Did this go through walls? It looked like it did. He wants to push me into tower. I'm fine though. Tank for me, tank for me. Mm. Gotta be a little bit careful here. I nice should Relic Dagger Glyph plus TP upgrade. I don't think I'm gonna build that this game, but I do like building that on tanks. Oh! Just slammed my head into him. Damage reduction on their heads. Give my time dilation to these guys. Oh! Oh, he reached me still. See, that's what's awkward. Like, I need to be... I have to be, like, away from them to get the time dilation. If I just, like, am near them, it's... Even though the rest of my kit wants me to be near them, it's just... It's a little weird. We'll get a binding now. Increase our damage numbies. Make us a bit tankier as well. Remember, I can't go Arc Druids because I can't proc the passive. And you die. They die. Unless his damage is really bloated compared to any other tank in the game, which it might be right now. There's no such thing as being near a carry late game and them dying as a tank. Just hasn't been a thing. I don't think for 120 is not bad. Can't wait for Benny to Benny to roll it up in mid. True, he will do that. I'll I'll go purple or uh, blue tiki. I kept putting points in my own or my one when I didn't want to. Oh, he's got a full Soul Eater, so. He'll be healing a lot. Push him out of his tower. <laughs> That's pretty good. I mean, bullying a Soul Eater Mulan with Genji's is pretty crazy. I'm just gonna ult. Got the time dilation on him. Got his ult, he's one HP. We'll get tower here. This should be a kill. Make sure we juke out his uh, three. I can TP him in now with my binding. Just gonna go blink because you always want to test out blink on tanks. See how viable it is on them. I don't mind tanking this. Oh! Push him back even further! Oh, the ring bounce! Or whatever that's called. Chain lightning. Nice. I'll take this wave as well, no problem. That does go through the wall. Damage reduced. Nice. <laughs> I have ult scenes, so. Time dilate him. I'm gonna stay back here so it actually hits him, so he can't move. Although my ones, my autos aren't hitting him, so that's kind of funny, but. I think we made use of it there. Am I still work for, work for these autos? I'd assume so, but. 
I don't actually know. Let's go Abyssal Stone. Why not? The Shirsong Gog? Alright, let's see if I like it. What's up, by the way, Sky Agent? How are you doing, bro? Almost missed your message. If you go mystical on him, yeah. You'd be doubled down. Only three pulses and I full clear the wave basically four. That's pretty crazy. Considering I'm full tank. Gotta choose the right one, but I have the big auto right now, so I... I'll go blue. So it shows you right here what your, uh... You get up to 100% haste effect, right? So I'm at 30 right now with the attack speed that I have. But I get more for my 1 because your 1 gives you attack speed. Gives you... Oh, it gives you it, it gives you haste. It doesn't give you attack speed. Or maybe maybe it gives you attack speed. It doesn't matter. They're the same thing about him. What's up, Krez? How are you? Gonna be trying to last week string worlds. That's unfortunate, Skyjin. I'm sorry, dude. I know this song. Is this their mid laner, by the way? I'm just gonna dive him and get tower. Look how hard I'm hitting the tower. This character might be the tower killer. Isn't this just spectacular to watch? Like what you're witnessing right now? Just two whales going at it. I mean, you could probably watch this on the nature channel, but discovery or something, but would it be the same? Thanks for the two months, Krez. Welcome back, dude. I appreciate it. <laughs> That's called sarcasm, guys. With Abyssal, you have to, it doesn't even matter because you have to hit abilities for Abyssal to proc, so. Doesn't even matter with the. that my autos won't proc. That's not how it works. A haste effect on tanks is pretty cool. Or a tank. I thought Hyra said they didn't want to add haste effects to characters. Think of the whale so far? Uh, in this game, he is a new character. Any new character that I play is fresh, so it'll, it'll be somewhat fun. Although, I sometimes I've been critical of some of the recent characters, but then I ended up liking them the more I played them. Um, but there are some things with this kit that it's very, very simple. And, um, it also feels like his animations should be, like, they should have more oomph to them. Oh, I think I know part of the reason why that might not be the case. Oh, I gotta hit that. The character's so simple, I can't even hit his abilities. And I also don't like that he can't proc uh, item of effects. And the argument might be, well, if he if he could, then he'd be broken, which is probably true. But then I would say maybe just change his kit because it's weird to make a auto attack focus god that can't even use like half the fun items in the game. Like one of my favorite things to do on any character is to go, especially like on guardians or characters that you wouldn't really see it on usually, is go like Death Toll Maui. Or go, um, like an auto attack build on a character that normally wouldn't have it. And the fact that, like, most of those items I can't even, I can't even use, it just, just a little sad. Because I think, theoretically, you could have just done, like, a, a Charybdis type thing where you just make it AoE auto if on it affects a lot less valuable on him. So just give him, like, a 20%, 25% coefficient. 
So if you go Destal, Baki Kajura, it'll still work. You'll still get some value, but it'll be, it won't be that much better than somebody who's getting the 100% with each normal auto. Oh, I could have got that if I just waited. Also, if the argument is he would have been broken with it, that's never stopped high risk before from releasing broken characters. In fact, I'm of the opinion that they should release broken characters. Are you copying my build, hippie? I mean, not that like I'm going anything groundbreaking, but the binding or the abyssal stones definitely aren't, like not normal. That hits pretty freaking hard. I'm gonna, uh, nah, I'm already at max with that, so I'll just keep that. Kind of want to hit 20 so I can go ornate or diamond. You don't want to go ornate for physicals. You want to go diamond. I don't line up top damage. Cancel that. Your average guardian is gonna take forever to. Uh, Clear camp, clear waves at this point, and I'm just walking around one shot and everything. I'm getting in there, guys. Sheesh. Where is he? Chasing this guy. Yeah, so Double J, thank you for the raid, dude. I hope you had a good stream. Appreciate it. Welcome, guys. I guess we could just get this. I'm actually autoing this for 94 without backdoor uh, removal for minions. That's pretty crazy. Who's tanking this? Atlas? I can control a big area here. Oh, into the wall. I also think it's kind of frustrating to get time dilated with like, like by a movable target that you kind of just like, besides the beading, you can't really do much about it. At least with Elrenal, it's like an area, it's, it's static. You see it, you can't reposition it. I want to try and kill this guy. I don't think I'll be able to. Oh, so close. I'm time dilated. Time dilated. Is Double J in your game right now? Dunghole abuser? That's that is my nickname for him, but I don't think that's him. Like I can't even go any of these items. I mean, I can. He's supposed to be a solo laner. I only would proc that with my three. Doesn't really matter what I go at this point. Maybe a last item prophetic. For some reason. Pretty win, pretty win key, okay. Yeah, I can see that. It's the new tech. The brand new tech yard. Freaking brand spanking new. I don't have a glyph, so I could just go Pridwing glyph. Or Pratsy with more auto damage, true. Your wife's new boyfriend, 96. He's in the weird category, but magical. He is a guardian. But yeah, you can kind of think of him as a magical warrior. Robin jungle OP now with his scaling buffs. Like, look at this. It's 
I'm I'm a guardian. I'm back during this for like 80. It's pretty good. The split push whale. Is that the play? I just ult to give him some time dilation here. I get him back while ulted. The more I can get prophetic stacks, the more my autos will do. Going ham. That damage. Rolls back up. Tank for me, Atlas. It's hard to tell when I'm actually won. Wanting. <laughs> Alright, we have minions here. Hitting it for 156, 160, 165. Oh my goodness. That's pretty gnarly. If I do say so myself, which I did. Or as I was ranging how they work, they're in a circle around you. This little circle, blue thing around me. And then it gets a little bit larger when I click one. And have that going. Yeah, you can stack your two on them. I don't think it does. I think it's maximum of 20%, but it, it refreshes it. I'm pretty sure. It's a seven second cooldown and it gets reduced when I hit my autos. Like, it's literally always up. Does he see me? <laughs> he does see me. Try and blink, push him into my thing. Oh, he caught my dash. No, he didn't. Oh, he walked into my fire. See ya. Gotta hit that. Gotta hit those. I'm walking at them menacingly! GG. They will definitely have some cool skins. I thought it was so funny. I was watching the patch notes while we were screaming and Clumsy said, he said something along the lines of, you know, we didn't want to make him look like your st your normal stereotypical whale. And I was like, oh yeah, I, exactly. I know what that means. You know, I see, I walk around every day and see your, st your own stereotypical whales. <laughs> normal whales are just so stereotypical is the thing. He does look cool though. GG kids. Gonna play Lego Fortnite now? Good luck, dude. Did 30k, mitigated 60k. Not bad, not bad. Build felt pretty good. Daily, thanks for 11 months. Welcome back to the Fonzo family. I appreciate that. Thank you, thank you. So yeah, my, my thoughts are, first game impressions, fun. I definitely had fun. But my criticisms are, seems a little too simple. Animations need a little work. IMO. And, um... Eh, that's probably it.